Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to a new series called Far Cry 6. If you guys do enjoy the series or just any episodes, make sure you hit that like button and make sure you hit that subscribe button. It would really mean a lot to me and I would appreciate it. I'll catch you in the next one. Heads up. Danny, some of our people are storming the tankers by the beach. Roger that. This is my last pitch to get you to buy into Castillo's plan, okay? Look, life in this country is hard now. It's an angry place. Death's all over. People are suffering. Everyone's dirt poor. Everyone's making hard life or death choices. What if I told you this island could be better? Are you reading one of Castillo's speeches? No, I'm serious. My great-grandparents had a brutal life. They left one country to go to another and made something of themselves. They passed that wealth on to the next generation. My parents. They built on it. They gave it to me. So, you want me to move? <sighs> well, that would solve my immediate problems, but no, no. You can stay in Yara, but Castillo wants a change here. He does. I talk to him every day. He wants it as fast as you do. Sometimes it is better to swim with the current than to go against it. So I should just accept the arrests, the outcast system, the executions. Every modern country in the history of the world has dark days. Only difference now is that everybody can film it and stream it and try to get the world pissed off about it. Even in my country, Canada, go look up what they did to the indigenous folks and the fracking Jesus Murphy. But hey, nobody is perfect. Talk all you want. You're nothing but a fucking invader. Ah, keep trying to be a badass. See where that gets you a couple generations from now. Think about what I said.
Attention unidentified pilot. This airspace is restricted. Land now. Coño! Yankee pay for what he did to us. And end Castillo's rule over El Este. Grabbing a right. Don't wreck this one, okay? At the port? As a matter of fact, I am. Sitting in my little fortified panic room. It's Russian made and impossible to open. And I'll just wait for Castillo's reinforcements. Great. I'll swing by and say hello. Look, backpack. If it's just you coming to see me, let's talk the situation over. I'll be unarmed. I won't. Shit. 
So much money flows through this one place. Yo de puta is mine. I will. How's it going there, backpack? Listen, I'm running late, so... Mierda. Elena, Mikay wasn't there. The office was a fucking trap. Cunio, that intel came from a fucking traitor. If I know anything about foreign invaders, they have one idea in their head if they're losing. Mikay has to be on one of those ships. You called it lucky. Oh, hell yeah! Oh, Elena, if the Yankee was on that ship, He's a dead man. He wasn't. McKay's on the one farther out. Are you sure this time? This intel comes from one of Gilberto's people. She's on that ship and has a visual on him. I'm on my way. Gilberto will get on the line.
news. My little pavilion on the ship sabotaged the engine. She says there's a hole and some smoke coming from the hole. You can't miss it. <laughs> you and your chameleons are fucking amazing. I know, but don't tell them. <laughs> Some chemical weapons here. I think the other ship had more. And Mikay? Don't see him. I will look up top.
I need cover! Seriously, it's been a good run, boys. Now, if you don't mind, backpack and move to talk over. Backpacks here. Danny, the situation has changed. I don't want to hear it right now, Juan. See, si, see, si, he's a skin tag on a weasel's asshole. Well. But we just made a deal. McKay is offering us a fuck ton of cash if we let him go. We're talking real dinero, Danny. No way Clara's good with this. I'll deal with Clara. You and I both know the real war starts the first minute Castillo dies. And you can't win that fight without cash. Trust me. We've been doing pretty good with bullets. Leave him alone and head back to the port. I'm on my way there now. It's time to celebrate. We won! <laughs> go on, backpack. Go, go. Join the fiesta back on the mainland. I'm sure they're going to have a piñata set up and everything for you. I'm thinking. Just like my grandmother always said. El este para siempre, Danny. Elena! Do you want me to believe McKay just floated away? Libertad deserves you. Let's hear it for Danny! You should say something. I've given enough speeches. Then I think it's only appropriate you that I your time, time, Lorenzo. Lucky. <laughs> Today, for the first time in my life, I actually feel lucky. When I look into the eyes of your generation, I see the same fire, the same passion, the same hope I used to see in mine. Together, we have the chance to create something new. It's your turn. Let's make this Yara's last war. La Moral, Legends of 67. Bienvenidos al Este, Clara. Welcome to Libertad. Gracias, but no. La moral's good on its own. Is that right? We'll help you kill Castillo, but we'll also keep an eye on Libertad. You want me to trust this wrinkled up abuelo to fix Ariara? No. We fight. We don't follow. I like this one. That's two of us. Si una esperanza. Vale. <laughs> <laughs> I know there are many who speak of the old Revolution of 67 like a dream. That these murderers were heroes? They will destroy your future, just as they did my father's. When I look into your eyes, I see lions. Libertad. La moral. Murderers of 67. These are lies. The truth? They are all known by the same name. Terrorista! I have a vision. To rebuild paradise. But these 
terroristas have made sure the cost of paradise will be blood. Let this be Yara's last revolution. Let us claim victory to the lions. Coño, wish you two were here. Where is this party at? Batter up. <laughs>